Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The start of the Android revolution is among us. So these freakishly realistic telemarketing robots are being used by a lot of big companies now. It allows them to save a lot of money by essentially just playing a computer program. But the scariest thing about these robots is the fact that when you try to get them to admit that they're a robot, they're going to deny that they're a robot. So Time Washington Bureau Chief Michael Scherer received a phone call from a woman who he described as bright and engaging when she was asking him if he wanted a deal on his health insurance. But he soon got the feeling that something was not right and probably a little bit uncanny. After asking the telemarketer point blank if she was a real person or a computer operated robot, she chuckled charmingly and insisted that she was real. This robot is denying that she is a robot. He continued to press the issue and asked her a series of questions, which she failed miserably. He asked, what vegetable is found in tomato soup? To which she responded saying that she didn't understand the question. When she was asked what the day of the week was yesterday, she complained of a bad connection, which is probably the oldest trick in the book if you're a cyborg robot. So listen, folks, I'm curious about this. We actually have the website for this robot, which you can call. I'm going to give you the number. It's 484 589-5611. I want you guys to call up this robot and see if you can get it to admit that it is actually a robot and post your experience in the comment below. I think that this is super disturbing and you know we kind of get into this you know they talk about the uncanny valley which you know with artificial intelligence where there's like this kind of portion where you know on one side we have robots that are you know, so robotic that it's easy to tell. And on the other side, we have essentially humans. And the uncanny valley is that weird place in between where it's just kind of weird. Like you get the sense that something's off if you're interacting with a robot or an Android or whatever. And I think we're in, in that lane now in terms of telemarketing. So call the number 484-589-5611. Let us know your experience about it. Maybe the robot will sell you some good insurance. I don't know about that. But in the meantime, hit that subscribe button. We got a contest going on. If by February 1st, we hit our goal of 1 million video views and 5,000 subscribers, Richard is going to go to our local Mexican restaurant. He is going to eat a five pound burrito in their man vs. food challenge. And I'm gonna film it. And you are going to get watch him suffer for the sake of our art. So hit that subscribe button and tell your friends about us.